Don't judge a book by its cover and don't judge a cable by its connector. Be sure to check the specs of the cable and the intended signal type. Just like the XLR connector, a quarter inch TRS connector has three separate connections, a tip, a ring, and a sleeve. They're also commonly used for analog, balanced, shielded audio connections. The form factor of these two connectors are different, but the general use of them is the same. You'll usually be connecting microphones with XLR cables, and that means you'll eventually have a good collection of XLR cables at various lengths. However, you'll find quarter inch TRS connections on many mixers, as you can fit more into a smaller space. When this happens, I tend to use a TRS to XLR adapter, partly because I have more XLR cables, but also to take advantage of the locking feature of an XLR connector. In my opinion, there's one particular brand of connector that are way ahead of the competition, and that's Neutrik. So no matter which brand cables you buy, I'd highly recommend buying XLR or TRS cables with Neutrik connectors, if possible. Before moving on to the next connector type, I wanna mention that you can also find TRS connectors intended for unbalanced stereo connections rather than balanced mono connections. A good example of this is a headphone jack. The three pins now act as left signal, right signal, and return. This allows for both the left and right signal to be sent over one cable, but we lose the balanced connection when doing this. 